Welcome to the weather forecast for the week beginning Wednesday, October 25th, 2023. This is Chief Meteorologist John Ensworth for Longmont Public Media. I'm on vacation this week, so I'm taking it a little easier and not putting all the graphics up this time, but we have a big snowstorm coming. Our first, it really looks like, is materializing, so we need to talk about that. So this is going to be a little different than other times. I'm going to switch over to this. Here's our upper air pattern. So right now we have the big ridge. The air's going south and north over us and then back south again. So it's just like a mountain of air. Um, that's what's been keeping us really warm and dry, kind of letting the smoke build up and stuff like that. If you put this into motion, this is going back to Monday. We had a storm pass south of us on Monday. And then today, Wednesday, that's passed, and then this goes far north of us. And then this big trough connecting the two jet streams goes all the way down to the desert southwest, crosses over the weekend, and leaves. Here comes the ridge back again, but I think cooler temperatures are still coming in. Then next weekend, another trough starts approaching the state, so we might have a couple weekend storms here. So looking at temperatures and how unusual they are. So this is departure from normal at the basically surface or two meters up. I'm putting this into motion from Monday, Tuesday. You can see the colder coming down, but it didn't get very far. Here's Wednesday. That's in Wyoming. Then Thursday, Friday, it spreads down. I can't get over the mountains at first. Very cold air going through the end of the weekend into the beginning of next week. And then the warmth in the west starts to kind of take over as the cold goes down into the south and southeast parts of the nation. Let's take a look at the actual temperatures at the surface. This red line in the beginning of the blue is freezing. So let's see how long it takes for freezing temperatures to get down here. You can see they are pushing down through Montana on Wednesday, Thursday, and to Friday, freezing temperatures at night. And then Saturday, Sunday, it really invades. There's 20s, 30s in the daytime. And yeah, you need that kind of temperature for snow. So it looks like we just might be in good shape. So let's take a look at this actual snow. This is going back. This is actually starting today. This is Wednesday. You can see a storm hits the northern mountains Wednesday night to Thursday. Then there's our storm right there for the weekend. and becoming just a normal cold front down in the deep south. We dry out. Let's take a look at this next storm. So there's next weekend. We had the ripple go by and there's a little snow in the mountains and yeah, a little brief hit of snow rain. That's a whole week away, so anything could happen. So this is Weather 5280s. I recommend you check out their site too. They have great forecasting going on over there. And you can see uh, yellow boundary is about five inches or more, and it's hitting the northern central mountains and in the southwest pretty well. We are like a one to two inch area so along I-25. The darker blue is three to four inches, so just a little west of the interstate. Looking at the GFS at weather 5280, you can see about a half inch of moisture uh, going up to almost uh, leveling up to Greeley, kind of, then more as you get into the central part of the state. Some significant water over there. Taking a look at the snow amounts, the GFS puts us in the, it's about three inch area, up to Fort Collins, four or five down here around Longmont to six. Um, yeah, eight inches close to Boulder, then northwest side of Denver. So still, we got some time for this to really come into focus. I will keep putting uh, the Canadian and the GFS and the NAM, the different snow totals, and eventually the uh, TV stations and where the 5280 will be coming out with their forecast. And I'll try to round it all up there as the weekend approaches. So let's take a look at this next week. This is based on, um, let's see if I can magnify that a little bit. Uh, this is weather undergrounds. 10-day graphical forecast, and you see we're in 60s now for the weekend, highs in the 30s, Sunday is very cold and morning snow. They have 3.1 inches for long long, and so you can see the snow kind of starts in the early hours of Saturday, peaks throughout Saturday afternoon and evening, and begins to taper off in the early hours of Sunday. A good classic 24-hour upslope Colorado snow. All right, so 
That was a little different, but this has been Chief Meteorologist John Insworth. Hoping you keep looking up.